Hey fam! The Atoms Research Channel is happy to welcome you to another step-by-step -step guide. Recently, the Tier 1 testnet has been updated, which no farmer can miss. So, pay attention and perform all the steps to avoid missing Barachain airdrop. Ooga Booga! Barachain is a basic smart contract blockchain designed to improve security, handle more transactions at once, and make using new technologies easier. Instead of a usual method where validators have to lock up tokens, Barachain uses a proof of liquidity system, where validators help by adding to liquidity pools in the network. They have already raised an impressive $142 million from top funds like Framework Ventures, Polychain Capital, and many more. So, we are jumping into their freshly announced testnet, version 2, Barshow, to increase your potential for airdrop distribution. You may find all of the needed links on the mirror page, mentioned in the description. Here we go! First, we need test tokens to start. Go to the Fawcett website. To receive the test tokens, you must have at least 0.01 Ethereum in your wallet. I think it was done to filter out the Sibyls, because the bear chain is the top tier 1 testnet, which is now farmed by thousands or tens of thousands of farmers. Or they just made it a little more expensive for us to complete the testnet. So enter your wallet address and press Trip Tokens button. You should receive one bear token. The faucet will be available for you again in 8 hours. I recommend requesting tokens several times, as you may need them in the future. Go to the BEX dev. Here's where we'll be swapping our tokens and adding liquidity. Perform multiple swaps to ensure that you have all of the available tokens. Move on to the pool tab, choose any pool and click add, enter the amount, approve the transaction and confirm it in your wallet. The liquidity is now added. You should test adding liquidity to the available pools later. As you have added the liquidity, the rewards will be provided to you with BGT tokens. BGT is a bear chain governance token. The more liquidity you'll add, the more BGT tokens for voting will be available for you. The higher the amount of BGT tokens will be in your possession, the more voting power you'll hold. Other ways to receive BGT tokens will be discussed later in the following parts of this video. Next, moving on to the bar show. Here's where we could turn our stables into honey tokens. Honey tokens is Barachain stablecoin. Enter the amount of STG USDC you'd like to exchange to Honey tokens. Approve the transaction and press Mint. Moving on to Bend. Make a deposit of BTC or Ethereum. After that, you will be able to borrow Honey tokens, and by doing so, you will be receiving BGT tokens. Also, you'll need to supply Honey tokens to earn more BGT tokens. Press Supply, choose the amount, approve the transaction and confirm it in your wallet. Now, we should have the Claim Rewards button available for us at the bottom of the page. The sooner you claim the rewards, the less tokens will be awarded to you, so it might be a good idea to wait a little bit. Visit the BGT Station website and click on Validators tab. Delegate your BGT tokens by choosing the Validator. You will be able to take part in the voting process in Governance tab, after some time passes since the moment you've delegated the BGT tokens. Here's another simple testnet activity. Burps provides an option for leverage trading. The minimum collateral to have a possibility to open a position is 10 honey tokens. Open and close a few long and short trading positions to complete this task. Try to do this with several trading positions and different leverage ratios. Click on the Vaults tab. It's a great, simple way to farm more BGT tokens by depositing your honey tokens. 
it will be possible to claim tokens a bit later, after the deposit is made. In addition to previous interactions, there is another way to farm BGT tokens. Go to their quests website and try to complete as many tasks as possible. Quests website is mentioned on the mirror page in the description. Also, it's always a good idea to farm roles in a Discord. The roles are often one of the most important criteria for a drop distribution. Join Barachain's Discord server and try to get as many roles as possible. Help other members of the server, create some memes or other content and be kind. And that wraps up today's testnet for Barachain. If you're interested in learning more about other testnet projects with airdrop potential, feel free to ask in the comments. We appreciate your time. So you could also share some love by clicking the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.